How brutal was the shoot? Um, we're talking about that bush specifically. <laughs> it was um, a horrible bush. <laughs> Thorny. Um, it was incredibly difficult. I think uh, the landscape was kind of equally beautiful and harsh. Um, I think we, in a way, needed it to be harsh. We needed to kind of face up to those real weather elements and actually be in and amongst nature in order mm. to capture, I think, what, what, what we captured. Um, but, you know, uh, the brutality and the harshness of the weather is also kind of you know matched by the sort of beauty of nature at the same time. So there's a, there's, there's a definite balance in the movie, um, but it it did make for a, a, a tough shoot, that's for sure. Mm. Um, how does um, Alejandro's style of shooting? How does that make things more challenging for 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 the actor? I mean, there's two ways of looking at it. Some of them are more challenging, but they're challenges you want to meet. They're not challenges that are there to just to mess with you or to be challenging. They're there because the film will be better as a result. Mm. And actually what they all led to, all those challenges, were better performances and, and a better film. So the, the fact that we were shooting chronologically, the fact that we were out in the weather and these crazy elements, that we were filming a long way away from home, and that, it, as you said earlier, it was just so unforgiving. All of those things in a way are challenges, but all of those things are also bonuses because it takes away a lot of the work. It gives you a lot to do, but it takes away a lot of the work of saying, right, well, how cold would I be? You're freezing. That's looked after. And so um, I think all the challenges he set us, actually, you're really able to grab hold of and use to make a better film and better performance. Um, this is the first time you guys worked with Leo. Mm. Uh, what surprised you about him? I don't, I don't mm. know if anything necessarily surprised me because I, I was well aware of Obviously, his uh, ability he kind of grew up watching him and admiring him. So, mm. I was not surprised to see that he really is as good as yeah. he's he's portrayed uh, in many different kind of circumstances over over a long career already. Um, I would guess I was really comforted to find out that you know his conduct on set and just the way he seems to be as a guy is sort of. Um, equally as impressive as his ability, you know? He's just a, a really lovely man. I guess, I guess actually one thing I did find surprising is <clears> how <throat> invested he is the, yeah. <laughs> that would be a headline. Under Sorry, all those layers, I still, um, uh, what I did find surprising is how invested he is in kind of every single element within the movie. You know, he had so much responsibility on his shoulders in this film. He bears so much of the emotional and physical brunt and he had so much to do and so much to go through, and yet he was still super collaborative, you know, um, very aware of absolutely everyone and, and every element, you know, in the makeup of of each scene he took part in, and, and that was that was quite surprising. I didn't yeah. expect him or feel like he necessarily even needed to do that, and he did. He kind of went he went that extra mile in every instance when it came to shooting the Revenant. Uh, Don, you've got two big movies coming out. Mm. This one and Star Wars, how do you feel about that? Uh, I feel good, you know. There are more famous people in bigger roles <laughs> than me in both those films, so it's grand. I can say, like, why don't you yeah, talk to Leo about that? <laughs> uh, you know, or Harrison Ford might have something good to say. <laughs> so it's fine. I, you know, uh, it's exciting because I think both films are amazing. And they're so different, but they're exactly the kind of thing when you're a kid, you know, like a kind of a mad Western, you know what I mean? Like, that's mm. how amazing is it to do that? And then Star Wars is its own thing also, so I'm very excited. It's in very, space. It's in space. Well, a spoiler, I mean, don't. Oh. Yeah, sorry about that. But you haven't seen yeah. the other ones. <laughs> yeah. 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 yeah, you could just be Star Wars <laughs> from Earth. And you're just like, oh, that looks vicious. <laughs> um, so, yeah, it's, it's, it's very exciting. And uh, I'm not, I haven't seen The Revenant. Uh, with all the sounds on, so I mean that's the big excitement for me is we get to see that this evening.